Road trip, no way! Hey yo, Carl here from Valorant, and I'm on a boat! Actually, we're on a road trip. We've packed the family up, we've grabbed the camping gear, and we're gonna check out the western fjords of Norway. And if you're traveling through the fjords on a road trip, this is part of the main road, catching ferries. So we're gonna go check out Geiranger Fjord. Uh, we'll go through Trollstegen and Trollvegen up to Andersnes. So it's gonna be super cool. And seeing it's moving its way into summer or the start of summer, sunsets at like 11.30 in the p.m. Uh, around midnight. So that's perfect for me to sneak out of the tent and go and get some shots of the landscapes uh, with good light. So let's roll! and there's no one here. It blows my mind as we travel around the east part of Norway. These places are jam-packed in the middle part of the day. There's tourist buses, there's people everywhere. And when you come, when there's good light and sunset, given it is midnight here, it's pretty much summer, so uh, sun doesn't really set. It'll be up again in an hour or two. But anyway, there's no one here. It's ridiculous. So I got Trollstegen all to myself. Beautiful sunset. It's fantastic. Managed to sneak away from the ladies. They are tucked up in bed. So I hooned up here at the last minute and grabbed a couple shots. Uh, pretty tricky lighting with a great sunset in the background and darkish foregrounds. So without using a variable ND filter, or not a variable, variable, graduated ND filter is what I was looking for. Uh, I don't really use those as it doesn't really fit my workflow, but instead I exposure blend. So I took a shot for the beautiful sunset and a shot for the darker foreground and we'll blend that in Photoshop. It's been rad so far. Uh, we've gone to some spots obviously as we're driving through and it's a family trip. So some spots are just uh, midday, not great light, but beautiful views. So soaking it up as we're traveling around and occasionally I get to take a banger. Woo! It's magical. I can't believe there's no one here. Everywhere we've gone, it's been loaded with people. So, uh, photographer's dream, I guess. <laughs> So 
so I've snuck away for another midnight sunset. Uh, shout out to Mark Bridgewater here for giving me this location. It is brilliant. We've got Romdal's horn here. We've got uh, Trollvegan or Trolls Wall over there and some other epic features just around. What a brilliant spot. We're camping just down in the lake. So it's a quick walk up for a brilliant location up in this area near Ondalsnes. Uh, my thoughts were shoot Romdal's horn with a spot of light as it leaves in the sunset. So we've got a few more minutes as the sun comes, peeks through the clouds at the end and uh, lights up the top. Now I'm a sucker for reflection foregrounds. So I'm gonna set up here with this little pond and uh, shoot Romdal's horn. I was hoping Trollwegen would catch a little bit of the sunset, but it looks like it's a sunrise spot. Uh, the question I now have is, do I sleep up here for two hours and wait for sunrise? Not sure on that one, but we will see. Anyway, this is brilliant. Driving around Norway, I'm always blown away at how much water is just pouring off the tops. And you know, it's meant to be summer and there's still snow everywhere when you get higher. Um, and I'm kind of still dressed like winter. So if you love waterfalls, Norway's your spot. There is waterfalls more than you can shake a stick at. But I better get set up and grab a shot before that sun completely disappears. So thoughts on this. I'm going for a Kind of a symmetrical approach here with the reflection coming down on the water from Romdalsjorn. I'm shooting at f8, uh, 1 20th of a second, ISO 100. I'm not using any polarizers or any filters. And that was the Norway road trip. Might stick around for a bit, get some dark and moody blue hour shots of Trollvegen. It looks like a death mountain, so we'll see if we can capture something there. Thanks for watching. Again, I'm Carl from Valorat. Check us out at photographygloves.com. Take a look at our resources page where we've got photo locations from all the best winter photography spots. So check out our posts on Norway and all the links will be down below. Happy shooting and we'll catch you on the next one.